What's up guys? This is Fitness for Quick Quick It. Cricket and I'm Joe and I'm gonna be taking you through another workout. This is day four of our boot camp. And so I'm just putting on my weights vest for this one. All of these exercises are body weight training, so you can either use just your body weight or you could add a vest if you want to. This is a fat loss and fitness based cricket boot camp for those of you who want to become more athletic. All right. Make sure that you're warmed up and ready to go. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Give this video a massive thumbs up and let's begin the workout. Let's go. All right then, let's do this. Make sure that you're warmed up and ready to go. Hit the pause button if you're not warm yet. Okay, good, let's do this. I'm gonna time this. We're gonna do it together, you be together, for bursts of 20 seconds and rests of 10 seconds. This is great for cricket conditioning, great for fat burning. So let's fuse it together and have an awesome 10 minute workout. Right, first of all, we're gonna start with a jab, cross, jab, cross, and then move, okay? Right then, 20 seconds. Three, two, one, let's go. Ready, jab, cross, jab, cross, and then move to a different position. One, two, three, four, let's go. Push through those hips. See your target in front of you. Keep the lights on your feet, just like you would be in the field. And relax, okay good, so 10 seconds rest. So next we're gonna do a sumo tap. Plyometric based exercise for the lower body. Ready, two, one, let's go. So drop into the sumo, tap in, tap out. So nice and soft landing. Keep your chest up high. So today I want you to find your own level, find the level that works for you, find the intensity that works for you. Two, one, good. Woo. Now, push-ups. I'm not sure it's the right choice to wear and weight the best for these push-ups, but let's give it a go. Two, one, let's go. Keep that core super strong. Ten seconds to go. Oh, I can really feel the difference with this vest. It's only five kilos, which just makes such a big difference to all of the movements. It's good for doing body weight based training. Okay, ready? Step and lunge. Okay, so we lunge, we step across, lunge, step across, lunge, step across, reverse lunge. Good. So just imagine a square and you're hitting the four corners of the square. Okay, good, so that's one round down, feeling good. So you know what the exercises are, let's see if we can take up that tempo just a little bit. Two, one, let's go. It really helps to imagine that you're making contact with the target, like a punch bag, because that way your muscles brace in all the right places. It's gonna be very good for your conditioning. Keep that core tight. Okay, good. Sumo tap back to our plyometrics. This is gonna get our lower body power improved. Let's go. Don't forget to hit that like button. It really helps me out, lets me know that I'm doing the right stuff for you, that I'm creating the right content for you. I wanna help you become the best player that you can be. Two. One, Woo. push ups, it's time to hit the deck. Let's go. Remember, keep that core tight, keep your bum squeezed. You can go down to the knees if you need to. Okay, it's time for the side step and lunge. Okay, so we lunge back, lunge back, and then move. So just with your arms, you're just pointing them to the direction that you're about to move. Just have to keep that chest up. Gets a little bit of rotation, a little bit of movement in the shoulder. Step and drop, step and drop. Rest. 
Okay, back to combat. Keep that guard high, defense before attack. Generate that twist by pivoting on the back toe. Just like you would do for a throw. Pivot on that back toe, push your hips through. Most of these movements are not random. They're things that can genuinely improve your performance whilst we burn body fat. Okay, so the sumo tap. Okay, here we go. Tap in, tap out. Soft landing. So like this one, very good for your lower body power. Balance and stability. And relax. Okay, good. Now we go down to the push-ups. Push-ups are just good to create that upper body strength. We haven't done any push-ups yet this boot camp. I thought you'd like it. Let's go. So we're halfway through the third round. Okay, good. Woo! Oh, feeling that best. Ready for those lunges. Let's try to take up the tempo of it if we can. So step that inside leg back, then across. Step back, go. Have a drink whenever you need it today. So work out. Have more than 10 second break if you need it. Whew. So all about finding the level that you're at. Like, great thing about this workout, you can pause the video and give yourself more time if you need it. Let's go. One, two, one, two, move. So we're into round four now. Good. Ah, Sumo so tap. Deep breath to get that oxygen in. Let's go. Keeping it soft, keeping your chest high. Keep sat back in your heels. How you doing? Make sure that you give this video a thumbs up if you made it this far. I want to know how many of you guys are getting through this workout and not just listening to the intro. Okay, right there. It's push up time, let's go. Keep that core locked in. Let's try to find that failure rep if we can. Okay, now we're gonna mix it up a little bit. So just follow my movements here. Now we've got the movement. Take up the intensity, ready? So jump, step. Okay, drop once, drop twice, jump step. One, two, move across. One, two, a little bit more balance required here. You feel that bum working a little bit more. Just activating those glutes. Keep your chest up high. All right, nice, that was smooth. Okay, one more round then. The finisher round. Let's go. Anytime I say duck, I want you to duck. Ready, duck. 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 Good, good. You're ready for anything. Okay, sumo taps, three to go. Let's go. So the knees and the toes want to point out in the same direction, out at 45 degrees. So we're tracking the toes, tracking the knees.
Final piece of work on the push ups. Okay, suck it in, get ready to go. Let's go together now.